Welcome, Saturday, to the Bolton School. And, uh, it's in a very posh part of, uh, Bolton. I was going to, um, do a story about the happenings with Hamas infiltrating southern Israel. I'm just doing a video, don't worry about me, I'm okay. Sorry? I can't hear you, so sorry, sir. I can't hear you, I'm sorry, man, I can't hear you. It's I've got the traffic right here, what's up? I said, go video our school, it's a school, it's for children. It's a nice, I'm not interested in, I'm interested in the sandstone. Go video the school. How about you go and tell someone else on another public pavement what to do, because I'm not interested, I'm sorry. You're not being polite, you're imp implying children, it's a sandstone building. Are there any children in my shot? No, please leave me alone, thank you. What are you going to do? You're going to radio me now. What are you going to call, call the SAS? Police? What are you going to call the police for? I'm stood on a public pavement filming a building. You, sir, are a fool. An F-O-O-L. Fool. As I said, sir, leave me alone. I don't appreciate being told what to do on a public pavement by a man in a nice fluorescent jacket. Leave me alone. My name is Bob Smith. You're an idiot. I'm an idiot. You, you know, you, you're calling members of the public an idiot. You're wearing the Bolton School. Do you think you represent the Bolton School very well? The hell's wrong with you? Eating as well, eating a burger while calling me an idiot. Strange man. Hey, hey, we can end this now. If you if you walk away, leave me alone. All right. He just said on the radio, very abusive. You just called me an idiot. Why are you calling me abusive? We get the police or something. Police or something. Get the SAS. Get the special arm squad. All right, no worries, man. He said I can take any pictures I want. He did. Yeah, I've got it on video. He actually said that. You're threatening me with police. You want me to put, be put in a cage for not obeying you. You think you have authority out on the public pavement. Could you um, help me out here? He's threatening to call the police on me. I was getting a few shots of the building. He's like implying children. I said I'm not interested in the children. Yeah. He says that it's illegal for me to film the school. I say I disagree. I just don't appreciate being called an idiot by a man eating a burger out on the public street, mate. We fought two world wars so that idiots like you couldn't tell off men like me. Sorry, bro. So to be honest, sir, it is our open morning. We do have a lot of people All right. and children in. All right. Somebody will not consent to taking photos, you see. No one's going to take any pictures of children. I'm a father of three. Yeah. I'm offended to the point that I want, I, I'm enraged. My blood pressure's up. My adrenaline's flowing. I'm very angry with you. I'm very angry with you. Yeah. So could you please take your awful dye job on your silver hair and leave me alone, sir? Please. You're not fooling anyone. You're not younger than you are with dyeing your hair. Please leave me alone. Please. All right. So if I go over here, you're going to follow me. Okay, good. Well, you're part of the story now, aren't you? All right. That's it. What you you're on with? What? 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 What's wait, your wait. reason for filming? That's all. It's none of your business, mate. Oh, I'm only asking. First of all, why you stood 30 centimetres? Thank you. Thank you. That's We're just asking the question. We're just on an open morning, so... Yeah. Just... The school is a historical building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. let me finish without jumping in. I wasn't jumping in. I just said Okay, yes. okay you're agreeing. Right. The school is a historical building. Yes. It's perhaps the nicest building in Bolton. Yes. If people show an interest in the architecture, 
It is ridiculous for a man in fluorescent to start talking about kids and how it's illegal. He's, he threatened to call the police on me. So I, I make videos. Yeah. I was doing a story about the school. Okay. That's it. I don't even have to tell you this. No, no, no. And well, he's like saying, don't get angry. I'll get angry if I want. I'm in public. That's fine. If, if you want to get angry, you can get angry. That, that's your choice, isn't it? It's everyone's yeah. choice as a grown adult. Yeah. As a grown man, Absolutely. as a child of God, whatever. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Under King Charles, whatever, yeah? Absolutely. Thank you. But at the same point, obviously, I've come out because you, you're getting abusive to one of my uh, members of staff. That's dis so, I can disagree with that. So, so you're accusing me now of being abusive? You've just said I can get abusive, so... No, I can you, get angry. Have you been? I can get angry. All right. Well, you're getting angry with one member. Being one accused of, of being stuff. accused of filming children. No. Would that not make you angry? I'm not saying. No, but would it make you angry if someone no. accused you of filming? If, if you stood outside a school with a camera, stood he's asked, he's, 70 he's yards a away from a building. I said, I said lots of children in the school. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Do you ever think that maybe I'm exploring the ridiculous security attack on people doing simple videos? You're free to walk away. If you want to take pictures, that's fine. But we are also in our rights to just ask what, what people are doing when they're taking pictures of a school that when we're is, on an open morning. That is fair enough. Exactly. Sir, so. could you please learn from your supervisor here that you could have approached me in a nicer way and asked me instead of saying, stop doing that, there's children here, which is what his opening line was. Right. Okay. Yeah. So, for, from, from my point of view... Yeah. Have you been before? Have you had? Have you, have you been to the school before? I'm not here to answer questions, no, man. No, no. no, come on. So, so you're not willing to just have a chat? Then? No, no, I'm not. No. no, I'm sorry. I'm already too angry. I'm too angry. I'm a grown man. Yeah, yeah. This kind of accusation is, is well, I'm not fill, it's, it, it, it's filled me with adrenaline it wasn't to the an point. Accusation. He's asked you to stop taking a picture. Hello. How are you? You okay? Are you also in security? No, I'm not. I'm a member of staff. Oh, I see. You got the CIA yeah, radio. So it's good. It's open. Yeah. All right. So yeah, yeah, yeah. It, they don't hear everything. That's, that's fine. Um, I think we're done. I oh, think we're oh, done. I I'm think we're done. If you, I'm more than happy to show you the school. If, if I, you I have don't. It, it's sorry, I know. You're not. You're interested on it. I'm, yeah. You're coming. I, I can't stay angry because you're giving off calm energy. But as a free man yeah. in England, on a public pavement. Absolutely. Walking yeah. around yeah. to have someone in a fluorescent uniform accuse me of filming kids when I'm filming in 20 mil wide angle. Yeah. It's the widest angle. You know what that means? That, I'm, I'm not. It's not. It's not a. Zoom, it's not a zoom in. So it's getting like a big yeah. wide angle. Like for so example. Let me, let me just. Let for me example. Just... See that? Yeah. The zoom doesn't even work. It's a wide angle. So That's I'm getting that. a wide angle. Let me just put. My perspective, I've been in teaching 27 If the years. perspective has anything to do with implying that I'm doing something no, illegal no, or no, nasty no, or against no, children... Not, okay, go on, okay. Not at all. Go on. What I'm, what I'm saying is that I've been in teaching for 27 years. Yeah. And in that time, I've been working with lots of different policies from the government and policies from everything else. Yeah, yeah. And it becomes... Unfor and it is unfortunate... Yes. ...that anybody who is seen taking photographs of schools... Of a big classical 200-year-old building. Absolutely. Happens to be a school. Absolutely. I don't agree oh, hello. with it. Hello, we've got yeah. more, we've got more, hello. Absolutely, no, I'm 100% I'm agreeing with you. Okay, what thank I'm you. What I'm saying is thank you. that it is unfortunate yeah. that, that can be seen as being some form of something that's wrong. I'm 100% agree. I'm, I'm suggesting. But you guys have made it escalate even more. The guy, I tried to challenge the guy, he was so rude to me, so rude, okay, so rude. Well, that's something for us to, us to deal with. Yeah, Obviously, yeah. not all our staff are trained at the same kind of levels. Yes. And, so, and their job is to protect the school okay. from things that they might see. And right. then, they, then they would call for people like, like right. Dave here and like myself. Right. As a who conciliatory are more, who are note. More trained. All right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to end my video. My name is Charlie Veach. Okay. I'm a YouTuber. Right, yeah, yeah. A lot of my videos are exploring the overreach of people when a right. photographer is trying to just say, oh, wow, nice but you, gothic, uh, neo gothic. I'm, I'm sure you can understand, sir. Yeah. People taking videos of schools sure. yeah. can be that's seen fine. by okay. people. Yeah. As something that's not quite right. Uh, I'm, I'm not, I'm not agreeing with that. Someone took a photograph of like Gordonston or Fetty's College or Eton College. Oh, look, it's where the, the sir, bloody sir, David Cameron if went if to university. Saturday, if it's any other Saturday, yeah. this wouldn't be a problem. It's our open All right. so every right. child is installed. Okay, so you guys, what you guys can do to conclude the video, you can say, sorry, Charles Veach. In fact, I think it's... No, I don't... That, I think that, it's... Um, I, I, I will say this, yeah. that I, I think that this is unfortunate 
point in life, in life we are at a unfortunate point in life yeah. that people can be seen as something they're not yeah. because of the actions of others. Yes. And the actions of others yes. that have taken photographs of children on playgrounds, and we've had that at this school. Yes, I know. And that is their, their actions lead to us being suspicious of others who we should That's fine. Be. That's fine. Let me just turn that. the camera a little bit. This, in a very far distance, two of your pupils appeared. So just well, to show as a sign of don't. goodwill. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. It'll be better. Yeah. I say if it was any other day, there wouldn't yeah. be a problem. All right. But now that you guys have established I'm a YouTuber, yeah. my, no, no, no. are you guys happy you to leave me alone like, now? Even if you weren't a YouTuber, we, yeah. we'd, we'd come out, we'd yeah, have yeah, a yeah. discussion with yeah, whoever yeah. it is. But yeah, yeah. You understand where we're coming from. Just to let the girl go back. I've got to go. I'm so sorry. Well, viewers, welcome to the liminal space, the neither here nor there, the town between towns. Is it even a real place or is it a kind of like dystopian shitty nightmare? The town of Radcliffe near Berry, where the police Toyota Corolla Cruiser frames the bargain booze in the background as the mobile and temporary traffic lights bisect the town into a stationary traffic jam. And the pigeons watch on forlorn. <laughs> good shot, Laura, good shot. <laughs> she threw them some bread and they kicked off. <laughs> as we enter into deep autumn, into fall, as the as the Yanks would say, limit, sorry, subliminal places like this that are neither here nor there just become even more bleak. Bleaker than John Calvinist's uh, fanciest house room in his house. Calvinism. Calvinism is back in fashion because nobody can afford anything. Radcliffe Piazza, don't worry, we're in a fancy town, the Piazza, the Corniche, the Boulevardo, Piazza, you are here. And uh, what is it here? It is a construction site. It's a construction site. I, I, I hope they demolish the whole town. Like that hospice, it feels a bit terminal. Right, Matawa Vich here says that this name is Haram, absolutely Haram. It's upsetting me. So I've stumbled across the office for this potato, uh, Christian Wakeford potato. Um, I would guess, in fact I don't know, is he Labour? Is he Tory? Is he Lib Dem? He's probably, probably Labour. But uh, he's, uh, he's working, oh no, it's all red in there. He might be independent for all we know, but there's a lot of red, so he's probably labor. Labore. And he's got his uh, Houses of Parliament symbol on the windows. It's, uh, yeah. Don't know if you can actually just walk in and meet MPs anymore, because uh, one of them met a gruesome end during one of the, why do they call it a surgery? Turn up, we'll sit down and talk and we'll call it a surgery. What's wrong with them? Don't name it after an event involving scalpels and cutting people. Just a thought. Well, Charlie, it's a good day to bury bad news. So you thought, surely it won't get any bleaker than Radcliffe. I present to you Berry Town Centre in the autumn. And, uh, I don't know, 99% of people walking around here look like they've got some personality disorder. Or maybe it's just me projecting. Chicken cottage. Okay. We are collecting some monies for, for the bursary funds. So if you do have a few extra pennies, there's a plate at the back. And if you don't have a few extra pennies, come back in two weeks' time. The plate will be there as well. Eighteen sixty eight, ladies and gentlemen. Moss. Full of tardigrades. Water piglets. Tiny little guys. Everywhere. Come on, Dean. What's up, Louise? We gotta get the little sparkly diamante French bulldogs underneath the live laugh love. Look at that. We gotta get under the live laugh love. Let's get our teeth done in Turkey and live in the bar at home.
Ahem. Ahem. Vertical Christmas tree. Ho, ho, ho. Horizontal floor. Ow. Spiky Christmas tree. Ho, ho, honk. <laughs>